Well, it has been three days since a rural Paso Robles woman vanished and was reported missing. Investigators are still searching for any signs of 62 year old Nancy Woodrum. KSBY news reporter Alexa Bertola joins us live from outside Woodrum's business. Alexa, what new information can you tell us? Well, Karina, we're learning that 62 year old Nancy Woodrum owns this salon near the corner of 8th and Spring Streets. Now, earlier today, there was a bouquet of flowers placed at the door, but that's since been picked up by an employee along with Nancy's client list. We, of course, love my mom immensely and wish nothing but a safe return and are devastated that she is missing, reads a statement from Nancy Woodrum's daughter, Amanda. Here's a new image of Nancy, who vanished sometime over the weekend. Neighbors reported seeing her on Friday afternoon. The sheriff's office says the exact time she went missing is not known. The family went to the house on Saturday morning. She had uh, missed an appointment with a friend, and so the family was concerned. They went to check on her, and when they arrived, they could not locate her. The sheriff's office launched an investigation Saturday afternoon. Public information officer Tony Coppola is saying any time you have someone who has seemingly vanished, it is suspicious, and that's why the forensics unit was brought out. Well, we have a number of leads that we're working, yes, um, and that's always a part of the investigation. So we're hoping those leads will, will lead us in the direction of where Nancy might be, uh, but in the meantime, we're also asking for the public's help. Her property along El Faro Drive was taped off Saturday and Sunday. On Sunday, a search and rescue team with canines found out across the area all the way to La Ponza Road. CHP's H-70 helicopter searched overhead. Neighbors say Woodrum runs the property as an Airbnb and lives in the caretaker's house. With an investigation underway and the sheriff's office actively interviewing those close by. Uh, we don't know at this point if search and rescue will be brought back out. And the sheriff's office was not able to say what type of evidence their search over the weekend uncovered. We'll continue to follow this story and bring you the very latest. For now, live and local in Paso Robles, Alexa Bertola, KSBY News. All right, Alexa, thank you. And if you have any information on Nancy Woodrum's whereabouts, you're asked to call the sheriff's office.